Today we're gonna to talk about how to draw a foul. Now the first thing to remember is you can't draw a foul if the defensive player is not fouling you. So if Brittany's gonna play me hand on, hips up, clean defense, this is not a foul. So I can do this all day. I'm likely not to be able to draw a foul. She's not fouling me. So if you wanna know what to do if the defender's not fouling you, you need to take a look at our pressure passing video. We cover that. But this covers how to draw a foul if the defender's fouling you. The first step is up and in, the same as in pressure passing. You can practice this step into a wall like I'm doing here. You wanna elevate up, getting your lead shoulder out of the water, and you wanna push into your defender perpendicularly, forming a T. By doing this, you'll keep the ball far away from the defender. It's important you practice and get strong with this first step. The higher you elevate and the more forcefully you push in, the easier it will be to draw the foul. Now we'll do the same drill with defense. Back up away from her a couple feet. I get my lead shoulder out, up, jam in. She catches me and I push. Now we're gonna talk about the part where you actually draw the foul. Letting go of the ball and getting into your man. What you don't want to do is appear that you're sinking. They're going to let the defender more often than not steal that ball from you. So we have to, at the same time, push the ball in the water, meaning let go of the ball, and push into our man with that off arm forearm that's already into them. So we're going to push and push into the man. Pushing into my man makes it very difficult for my defender to get the ball if they don't call the foul for me. So if I don't push into her and they don't call a foul for me, look how she can take the ball. So I didn't get the foul call, now she stole the ball. But if I push the ball in the water and go into her, take the ball. She can't get the ball. So worst thing that happened is I don't get a foul call, but I still have the ball. So it's very important that you push into your man. You wanna have your hand on the side of the ball, not on top. This is gonna make it easier to spin it, and it's also gonna make it harder for the defense to do a ball under. So not here, but here. What you wanna get good at is spinning it so it's nice and close to you, so you can pick it up right away. You don't wanna get in the habit of spinning it way far away now you gotta swim for it, get back in. Now let's take a look at this all together. I go up and in, I let go of the ball and push into my man with my forearm and draw the foul. After I draw the foul, I quickly get the ball up and ready to pass. Some of these elements we also cover in more detail in our pressure passing tutorial. And if you're ready for a new challenge, check out our five meter draw foul and shoot video. Please subscribe to our channel. Check out all our videos coming out from Shaquatics Water Polo. I'm David Farkas. We'll see you next time.